Well, maybe that's a, the wrong question to be asking me. I, I think the question here that we should all be asking is how we feel about how Indigenous women are treated in this country and in particular in this province. Uh, after the numerous reports, after the Starlight Tours, that's the history of this province, after the history of residential schools, after the history of removing Indigenous children from their mothers and from their families, after the history of missing and murdered, which Ms. Walker has advocated for her entire life, I, I think what we need to be asking ourselves is when it's going to occur to this government, the federal government, and the Saskatchewan government that something has to be done about the way the Indigenous community is dealt with in this country and in this province. You should know that in Saskatchewan, 80% of women who are in custody right now, in jail, are Indigenous. And that is a statistic that is incomprehensible. It is one of the highest in the countries, next only to Manitoba. It is inexplicable when you know that Indigenous women do not form 80% of the Saskatchewan population, and that tells you what the government thinks of their value and their lives. So what I hope uh, comes out of this uh, is that some of those questions are going to be asked and finally answered because it is long in coming. And Ms. Walker is just one in many of a line of Indigenous women who has felt the wrath of what it feels like to be a woman in this province of that history. Thank you.